If you're arrested for driving under the influence or DUI, the legal process follows the laws of your state. You can typically expect the police to fingerprint you, take your mugshot, and administer a blood alcohol test at the station. Depending on your situation, you might be able to bail out immediately afterwards. If the prosecutor files charges, you will likely have to go to court several times. Often defendants must choose between plea negotiations with the prosecutor or going to trial. An attorney can help you weigh the pros and cons of each alternative in light of the facts. If you're convicted, you face fees, fines, and possible jail time. A DUI conviction typically results in a suspension of your driver's license. In some states, the Department of Motor Vehicles conducts separate proceedings for license suspensions. It's sometimes possible to get a restricted license during your suspension if you have to drive for work or school or to care for your family. To get your license back, you might have to undergo a substance abuse evaluation or counseling or install an ignition interlock device in your car. A local criminal defense attorney can explain the DUI court process for your state in greater detail.